What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Juggalo972 back here, and welcome back to Juggalo972 Replays after Razor 2. Now, in the previous episode, we were going, I said we were going to go towards, uh, go towards Greed and the Tower of Souls, or in this case, in the Japanese version, Tower of Babel. But we've got one more that we got to take care of, and that is Glut, uh, not, yeah, it's Gluttony, yeah, in Temponia. The time to overconsumption. Yeah. Yeah. Madero. This is, I, I, I gotta admit, though, this one was interesting, too, because the just the mouths these weird mouths that just sit there and just chew and eat at the world that comes through uh -huh. oh my god it's, it's nightmare fuel if you really look at it it's also very gross yeah nightmare fuel my, nightmare fuel this is something out of this is something uh. of, uh, of uh, nightmare on street but look at all these look at all the skeletons and skulls look at all the and like the hyenas you know went through uh, pride rock look at that yeah that's exactly what it looks like but worse yeah but worse if scar actually legit took over and killed simba where is your hunting party they're not doing their jobs ah oh okay. leave it to like a bird or a hawk they're the big they're one of the well, biggest predators well that's a that's a buzzard it's a, a go yeah, the, uh, buzz, that, uh, uh, sorry, I can't talk. But yeah, a buzzer goes after uh, goes after things that are dying. Yeah. They usually, uh, they're scavengers. Oh. They're scavengers. You want to talk about great savages? It'd be those buzzards. Yeah, yeah but they scavenge enough you know, for stuff that's already been that's already been killed too. So they usually fly around something when they sense death. Yeah, vultures too. Yes, vultures. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah. Okay, that hurt. Mindless. It's like they're mindlessly just crave. Mindlessly crave. That's what. Oh, yeah. I, I hit down, man. Come on. Seriously. Okay, let's try this again. Like they're mindlessly craving. Oh yeah. Your flesh. Endless hunger. You know what I mean? Tis no man. Tis an end. A bottomless feeding machine. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not talking about Homer Simpson here. No. <laughs> All you can eat. Buzzards, yeah. You'd be surprised what birds, how vicious birds can get, especially buzzards and vultures. It's mm, buzzards and vultures, yeah. Yeah, you be, you be. They are wicked. Ruthless too. I mean, we've seen bug life. <laughs> You've got to be joking me. See, there's also another reason why I can't stand Act or 2 is difficult sometimes. It's difficult to, to be difficult. Yeah. There's like no rhyme or reason to it, though. It's just difficult to be difficult. Yeah. It's just being a, basically just being a dick. Like I said, at least Dark Souls has replay value with something like that, though. I think it's also another reason why uh, everybody also hated Act Razor 2 this much, though. Now, I will say, though, the Japanese ver I'm, I'm thoroughly enjoying playing through the Japanese version. Um, and I gotta tell you, you know, it's definitely... Sub I feel like, you know, this has the Japanese version has more replay value yeah. in, the, in that sense. Damn it. Nope. Add, well, extra life I can't get. But yeah, I definitely feel like it's got more replay value in that way, though, because it feels more balanced out. Mind you, this is still the normal difficulty, too. Obviously, a lot of these the skeletons you see here, they die of hunger. Yeah. Or maybe these demons ate them. <gasps> oh, I forgot about that. Okay, so this one... Oh, so they, they do come back up. Yeah, I was under the impression that they go... They just keep going down. Mm -hmm. Again, the, 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 the mouth... The mouth um, thingies. The mouth thingies. Oh, no! What? I've... That, there was some health right there, and it disappeared. Ouch. Maybe, maybe he might have some. Kind of hope so. Nope. Look at that. What, buzz, what makes you so different? He breathes fire. I think the, other, I think the regular ones do, too. Here, let's just get rid of him. Get rid of him. Moldero. Alrighty. That sounds like a beer. <laughs> oh, that's Modelo. Yeah, I know. <laughs> That's oh, Modelo. There you go. That's Modelo. Modelo. <laughs> uh, <wee. laughs> this looks like. This looks like we're in his stomach. 
Kinda, yeah. Get more A very mouths. inflamed, ulcerated stomach. I don't know, man. Ulcerated and parasitic. Yeah. All the tooths. And the parasitic and hemorrhoidal. I don't want to talk about that. I mean, look at, I mean, look at the spikes. I mean, as someone who Here suffers from IBS, this looks like... This is, this is like, a, like a horrible nightmare. This looks like a horrible nightmare, and... Okay, everything's spiky too. Oh, okay. So you still, you know, do take a lot of damage. Uh, oh, dick! But, uh, you even start to, you even start to look like Kami. <laughs> dick. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah, I had to take one as a mulligan though. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I I will say this though. If if you want to give this uh, game a little bit more uh, replay too. Do you like how Dark Souls does? Give us a stamp, give us a stamina meter, mm -hmm. and let us be able, and let the master be able to run. Yeah. Matter of fact, let the stamina meter, you know, actually go with the way he jumps and floats. Mm -hmm. yeah, th th this, yeah. Because if you can't manage that stamina meter, man, you know you will not survive. Yeah. Yeah, your your whole survival depends on that stamina meter. Yeah, and also let this let this let this deadly sin level remind you that what you. Feed what you eat, what you are, what you can be, you can be what you eat. You are what you eat! Yeah. <laughs> Let this be a reminder. <laughs> what you put in your, what you feed yourself is very important. Yeah, and you do your research too, you're just going to be like one of those people who just spat out a bunch of crap in their mouth, you know? Hold on. <laughs> Stop, Mark. Yes. Damn it. I've always found this this level to be very disgusting. Alright. Okay, fine. I think I'm gonna be okay. Okay. Alright. Now I don't expect to beat this boss. But I'm going to try anyway. Oh. Yeah, this Oh Yeah, this thing. This guy Sorry, it looks like a this thing looks like an alien. Yeah, it does. You know what else it looks like? It looks like a phazon from a from a Super Metroid. This shit. There we go. Oh, he's got an opening on his side. If you mm -hmm. if you didn't. Yeah, see it. it's got it, a it's, it's got a, another mouth there. Yeah, it's almost like I, I thought maybe he ruptured something from eating too much, and that's the thing about gluttony. Yeah. You eat more than you consume. If you eat enough, you can ex your stomach can explode. Oh yeah. Yeah, you got flesh as a. You see what I mean? <laughs> Alrighty. Alright, here we go. We've got flesh as steps. As stepping stones. That's really Yeah, would you look at that? Now... Oh, wait, that's a password there. Alright, let's see. Now, people of, uh... Don't, don't share? Don't share near as much? Now, it's time for the demon cave, where in this case, uh, the original, I believe, is the ant cave? I believe it's the, ants ca I the ant cave. I think so. Or the creature cave, oh. I believe. I don't know, I gotta go back on the tapes on that one. You want uh, this is a, this is a sign of true. These, these are actual signs of true gluttons. I I honestly but, believe. But I will say though, it's a true sign of community and unity as well. Yes, it's that's interesting because what you're about to see ants, ants, bugs. This and this is for the colony. Colony, yeah. When you this is a this is a true. This is a mighty fine example of gluttony. But like you said, a community as well. And it's like, unity. It's like, we're always hungry. Oh, insects will eat you in a minute. Mm -hmm. But you know what? And if, if anything, too, if, if you've got cats as well, they know that you're dead. They will eat you. Yeah. But, you know, you are you become one of them. Yeah, you do. But, like, it's yeah. interesting. You, you were talking about, you know them being a signal of unity and, com in a, and community because we've seen ants uh, outside mm -hmm. we've seen ants outside like just dragging like things like twice their size um, oh yeah they're strong oh yeah like you, you, you gotta know like 
That's a that's a that's a strength right there that you have to respect. Yeah. Especially for just from one ant to carry something that about like thirty six times its own size. Yeah. And that spider, uh, that four legged spider, it shouldn't even be a spider. spider it, it should be dur. Just a dur. Dur. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. That's all I'm gonna say about the spider because the last. I'm not, I'm not. I'm gonna try not to talk shit about spiders. Uh, because the last time I did that, I was playing Crash Bandicoot with one of my best friends, uh, Vanessa, shout out to her. Um, there's a, there's a level in Crash Bandicoot where there's a six-legged spider. Just, and that just happened. Yeah, just hanging. And every time, I, and I would always talk shit about the spider, and yet every time I talk shit about the spider, both Vanessa and I would end up dead. <laughs> Don't talk shit about spiders. Don't talk shit about total. Yeah. So every so every time I would make a comment about it, Vanessa would be like, "That great, get Mandapanda." <laughs> that great, you gotta watch. You gotta watch your stuff, man. Yeah. Hold on a second. I think there's a way I can actually get through here. Hold yeah. On. Nope, I can't. Okay, so I guess that only it's only that little. One. Speaking of spiders, um, I, I, w I will say this, like, as far as spiders are very unique. I I'm arachnophobic. Mm -hmm. I'm arachnophobic. I oh. have... A, what woman isn't? I have a fear. I have a fear of spiders, but at the same time, I also have a fascination of them. But, like, as far as gluttony goes, like, spiders are are a hell of a sim- or hella symbolic for that, because they, they build a web. They build a web and they just wait. Mm -hmm. They just wait There's, for somebody to come through. And they're, they're hungry. They're always hungry though. They just sit there and they wait. They sit there, they're hairy, and they're quiet. Exactly. Yeah, and they're quiet. <laughs> they're so quiet. <laughs> Very quiet. <laughs> Archer, man, the, guy's, the man's a national treasure. Yeah, Archer, the love and death. Uh, um. But once they he once they get a sense, once they get a sense from their webs, boom. Mm -hmm. They're on it like shit on Velcro. Yeah, but spiders are very. The female spiders are heavier than the male spiders. Yep. The female spiders are a lot deadlier. Yep. They got more venom in their system too. They got more venom in the their one, system. Out of all the ones that have poison, though, they have the most venom. Yeah. So, and spiders will eat other spiders. Yep. That's the fucked up thing about that them. They don't care, man. They don't care. I will I will eat you. It's like, oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna eat you. And the spider web speaking of spider webs, there's, there's webs all over the place. Yeah, it definitely distorts your uh, vision there. Oh Yeah, and these, and these little these little shits, the way they just sit there and they just respawn. Flying larva. Uh, I'm assuming that's flying. Very obese flying larva. There it goes again. Jesus. There it goes again with the just difficult, you know, just sitting there just being annoying. Yeah, annoyingly, yeah. You know, difficult just to be difficult, you know, difficulty just for difficulty. It's like a clean. It's like an attention whore. <laughs> oh, please tell me that. Oh, good! Yeah, more health. The, yeah, but the. There we go. The ins insects and arachnids, they're very interesting creatures. Um. Hello. Man, you are one ugly father mucker. Uh, a scorpion. Oh my goodness. Scorpions. Uh-uh. 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 Come on. What are you going to do? There we go. There we go. There we go. I've been trying to perfect that. Yeah. Since we started the last episode. Scorpion. Off camera. Yeah. <sighs> oh. Ant's Lair, Demon's Cave, what do you want to call it, though? Complete. I think it's actually called Demon's Cave in the Super Nintendo version. I yeah, think. I think so, too. I think so. Or, uh, don't don't quote us. We'll, ch we'll double check. <laughs> Alrighty. Scorpion, speaking of scorpions, the boss, that's a lot deadlier than a spider. Actually, that's a that's a, another ant. It's got a scorpion's tail on it. Though. I know, right? <laughs> but, it, but the way it just hangs off the, uh, the ceiling, too. Yeah. Alrighty. And in the next episode... Pride. And no, not that kind of pride. The deadliest of them all. Pride. See you in the next episode. Peace!